Yes. Yeah, so Sophia, did you see the guy outside the school that said that women were divinely created for men's pleasure? I remember that clip. There was a clip. Uh, they got some of these protesters, these Muslim parents outside these this primary school protesting the LGBT education, whatever. And uh, one of the guys said that, no, this is wrong. It's like women are created by Allah for men's pleasure. And that's exactly what he said. Talking about the over-sexualization of children, and then somebody says that, like, what? I just think, like, where do you even go from there? You know, uh, like that's a it's a women's rights nightmare. Okay, I have an opinion on this because, to be fair, that got a, a lot of reactions. A lot of like that video got uh, a lot of people were pissed that this man is saying that. For me, it's very strange that that got a huge reaction because that's in the Quran. I mean, I, that's in the Quran. I, I don't understand why the Quran says that men have uh, authority over women and they can beat them. N not that they can beat them, that they should beat them they should. when they're when they're not when they are disobedient. When you fear disobedience, like, but this guy is what he's saying is nothing compared to the Quran. So why is there so much outrage over what this guy, this Muslim guy, said in the street? And not nothing over a book that is circulated all over the United Kingdom and people mm -hmm. are teaching it in mosques and people are reading it. No outrage over that at all? Why are they calling that out? It's because deep inside they know that they can't attack the book. They know that the book is just as bullshit as the guy, but they're going to attack the guy because he's an easy target. They, they're not going to attack the book because that's not proper. Secular Jihadists is an increasingly influential podcast with much of its growing audience in Muslim-majority countries, advocating for atheists, secularists, and Enlightenment thinkers. We want to reach out to more people. If we reach 500 patrons, we will be able to translate our shows into Arabic, Urdu, Persian, Bengali, Malay, Turkish, and other languages in these countries. Help us get there at patreon.com slash sjme.